maybe a more painful reality is that when they come to many of our dominant group churches, and I was blessed, I was brought to the Lord in a dominant group church, but many of my second and third generation Latino friends, even family members, wouldn't feel comfortable in most of our dominant group churches. Because many times we make them feel when they come as though they really don't belong. We, we say silly things like, um, oh, your people are meeting down in the fellowship hall. We try to practice our Spanish with them when they don't speak Spanish either. Or we say something silly like, oh, what part of Mexico are you from? And if they're not Mexican, we've really offended them. And then if they were born here, as most of them are, we've offended them again. And so we send messages to them subtly, uh, reminding them that they really don't belong here with the dominant group. They really belong down the hall in the fellowship hall with the Spanish-speaking group. And yet, as I've just mentioned, when they're with the Spanish-speaking group down the hall, they're down there and many of those people are saying, why don't you go with your friends? Why don't you go with your people, the English speakers in the dominant group? They don't feel welcome down there either because they don't speak Spanish well enough. They don't understand all of the cultural idiosyncrasies. They're too Americanized, or as we would say, they're too agringado to fit in. And so many of them just wander the halls if they stick around our buildings at all. Most of them just get in their cars and leave the parking lot. That's why I'm so excited about Genesis Alliance. Genesis Alliance gets this. They understand that the future of the Hispanic, of Hispanic ministry in the United States is going to be different than our abuela's church. And it's going to be different than the model that we have used for the last four or five generations here in the United States where we have a Spanish-speaking group down meeting in the fellowship hall or in a chapel while the dominant group is meeting in the auditorium. We're going to see new churches reaching new Hispanic populations in the future. And I'm thankful for the ministry and the vision of those involved with Genesis Alliance because they're going to lead us in that path.